police state for the rise of FEMA, police state for the rise of FEMA, and they will both premiere in the next week and a half at PrisonPlanet.tv. Thursday at 3 o'clock Central, when this radio show ends, the first place it will be available in the highest quality. We've got DivX versions to burn to disc. Uh, that's one of the medium quality ones. All at PrisonPlanet.tv, 15 cents a day, five ninety five a month. Get a yearly membership, get three months free. And your support of PrisonPlanet.tv also makes this radio show possible. You go get a 15 cent a day, five ninety five a month membership. You can share the passcode with up to six people. Six people with the same passcode can log on simultaneously. Just tell them, don't share this with anybody else. So we can't afford the bandwidth. But I did turn it up to six a year ago or so instead of three so that you could share it with friends and family. Give them your username, passcode. They can watch the live show. They get access to the 64 kilobit audio streams, video streams, the 64 kilobit podcast, uh, all my films, a bunch of other great documentaries, uh, Paul Watson's book out of print, my book out of print. It's now six years up and running. We launched it in early April six years ago. In 2004, we are now six years of PrisonPlanet.tv, and we're adding more to it upgrading it. We did an upgrade last year. We're doing another upgrade in the next few months, making PrisonPlanet.tv better and better and better. It's an armory of info weapon resistance. And it is the it is the depository of the modern committees of correspondence of common sense. Videos are the new pamphlets, and it's up to you to carry them to the four corners of the planet. And we're about to drop two big info weapons in the next few days. PrisonPlanet.tv. We'll be right back. Thank you for listening to GCN. Be sure to visit GCNlive.com today. They helped to create a new world order. We are part of a new world order. A new world order based upon collective action. Invisible Empire is a damning indictment of the globalists through their own words and documents. The new world order really is a tool for addressing a new world of possibilities. It means all the world under their control. The United Nations would take over America. The Trilateral Commission would control the world. Invisible Empire chronicles how men of power and influence have worked in stealth for centuries to establish an oppressive world government. I believe, first of all, that we now need nothing short of a world constitution for the global financial system. Global governance with the establishment of the G20. So it's going to be an inner ruling elite and then everyone else. And I got news for you. You're everyone else. Invisible Empire. Secure your copy today at InfoWars.com or PrisonPlanet.com or watch it online in the highest quality at PrisonPlanet.tv. Waging war on corruption. Alex Jones on the GCM Radio Network. We are live, ladies and gentlemen. We're getting Jim Tucker on the line. After working for various newspapers, Tucker started writing for the... Uh, Spotlight in the 70s. He now works for American Free Press, the reincarnation of that paper. Tucker's efforts to infiltrate the 99 Bilderberg meeting at the hotel uh, in Park Central, Portugal, were chronicled by British reporter John Ronson in his book, Them. He's also been in Channel 4, Secret Rulers of the World. He published Jim Tucker's Bilderberg Diary. Tucker is featured prominently in the film made by paleoconservative Alex Jones, Endgame, Blueprint for Global Enslavement. And, of course, uh, we are honored uh, to have him uh, with us today. He's also uh, featured in the documentary film New World Order 2009. And uh, Jim has identified, and he's always been accurate in the past, uh, Jim has identified Bilderberg meeting in Spain. Now, I saw people commenting on Infowars.com last week when some were speculating that it was going to be in England. Or Spain. Now Jim's confirmed it's Spain, and he's always been right in the past. And the Bilderberg sometimes will rent multiple hotels, put out this info to find out what moles they've got. Uh, people are commenting, well, why don't they just have it in Japan? Why don't they just have it in Africa? No, they only have it in Western Europe, the Caribbean, or Canada, or the U.S. They do three years in Europe, 
one year in the U.S., three years in Europe, one year in the U.S. That's how it's been done since the 50s. And this is the group that set up the European Union. This is the group that set up uh, this entire system. And so we're working on getting Jim on, and uh, that'll be coming up in the next segment, uh, hopefully. Uh, I also want to continue with news, but right now let's go back to your calls uh, let's talk to Jimmy in Michigan. Jimmy, you're on the air. How you doing today, Alex? Good, sir. Hey, uh, um, I, I talked to Michael Savage, and I finally made it on your show, on your website. It was amazing. Uh, you're the guy that know... called in and talked about how they set up the Hatari militia, and now it, they've released their best evidence. The guy's like, yeah, the government keeps pushing. We'll have to fight them someday. I mean, every most Americans have talked like that. Boom, you go to prison. Right, I, I, I understand that. And, and I also would like to point out that Mike Meeks, Michael David Meeks, the, the one, one of the guys, I can speak for him because I've known him for over 30 years. I've broken bread with his family. He is welcome in my home. He was going to be best man at my wedding on the 8th of May. Uh, this is my friend. I've known him forever. There's no way that he would have ever been involved in any kind of conspiracy like this. He is the kind of guy that wanted to change things, but he, he was always doing it in a civil way. He, was, he ran for Republican precinct delegate and became one. And uh, we've been talking about Ann Norlander for uh, Secretary of State, uh, Michael Bishop for Attorney General. We just started digging into the, the, the guys that are well, running. Well, look, 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 look. The media is saying I'm calling for insurrection and violence when I'm not as a way to make us the bad guys and let the system have the moral high ground. And, and, and the best evidence they've got is the supposed leader, Stone, and he doesn't say anything you should go to prison for. I mean, talk show hosts say much more extreme things every day. And so clearly this whole thing is a setup to create the illusion there's all these violent militias out there. Exactly. And, and Mr. Uh, Mr. Potak, who's certainly welcome to his opinion, uh, why doesn't he come and talk to one of us? I'll debate him anytime, anywhere, no problem. I, well, obviously they don't want the truth getting out, and they want to continue with the illusion that anybody that criticizes the government is a terrorist that wants to murder people, while the government uses more and more force against the citizens every day in this country and gets more and more oppressive and sells us on the idea of police dogs attacking old women at the G20. But I'd like to get your name and number and, and, and perhaps uh, have you on as a guest uh, to talk more about the Hatari and maybe get some of the other locals on with you uh, that knew some of these people so we can dispel the propaganda. But I saw them being set up when that pale horse guy, Sickles, and they admit one of the members is a Fed, and I don't know who it is, but I've had my suspicions. Stay with us. Stay. Hi, this is Alex Jones. Did you know that the global elite are now storing non-hybrid seeds in secret storage vaults near the Arctic Circle? Did you know that in a real meltdown, non-hybrid seeds can become more valuable than silver or gold? It's true, seeds have outperformed even gold and silver before in this country, and it's possible that it could even happen again. So our friends at Solutions from Science have put together the perfect mix of non-hybrid seeds. They call it a survival seed bank, and it can produce an endless supply of nutrient-dense food for you and your family. And here's the best part. These seeds have not been genetically modified in any way, and you actually get enough seeds to plant a full acre crisis garden. So visit them today at survivalseedbank.com. That's survivalseedbank.com. Or give them a call at 877-327-0365. That's 877-327-0365. Remember, in a real crisis, non-hybrid seeds are the ultimate barter item. This is Alex Jones for SurvivalSeedBank.com. One major world crisis away from having a totalitarian type of system. The main event is the, the wholesale destruction of the world economy. The push for every nation on the globe to identify and number all of its citizens. Friends, I hope that you will order Shadow Government from InfoWars.com. We also have some specials where you can get some of our other films half price when you order Shadow Government. A new level in production quality and in information. It exposes how a cashless society surveillance beast grid of total uh, control is being put into place. This film needs to be seen. Everybody needs to get it. So order yours today. Show it to your friends, your family, your church, your neighbors, your boss, your employees. 
Shadow government, ladies and gentlemen. Get your copy at InfoWars.com today. Shadow government. It gives Big Brother a black eye. Available at InfoWars.com or by calling toll-free 888-253-3139. Hello, this is Alex Jones with some important questions. If you're going into a battle and they give you a rifle and a sidearm, how much ammunition do you want? My answer would be all I can get. In the